Hey guys, this is Mark and welcome back to the channel. So this is part two of four videos on how to set up your uh, Lasco home devices. So in this video, I'll teach you how to set up your smart plug. Okay guys, so ito na yung Lasco smart plug. Uh, let's try to set it up. So I have my cell phone and my extension cord. So uh, ito yung Lasco Eco Smart Plug. Uh, it's compatible to uh, with Lasco app, Smart Life, uh, Amazon Alexa, if you have your Alexa, your Google Home, if you have your Google Home Mini, or Google Home Speakers, and then Google Assistant, if you have an Android TV, a may Google Assistant, or if you have uh, your cell phone, your Android cell phone. Okay. So first thing we need to do is download the app, uh, the Lasco app. So go to your Play Store or Google or, or Apple Store, search for Lasco. I've already downloaded mine. Okay, so the first thing that it will uh, ask is to register. So hihingi siya ng uh, email address. So just put in your email address and then once it's there, it will send a verification code uh, in your email address and use that to uh, activate the, the app and then it will ask for your default password, uh, for your password. It will be your default password moving forward. Okay, so now nagawa na natin. Uh, let's add a device. Oh, very nice. So ang daming, ang daming uh, ho Google Home or smart devices na compatible sa app na to. We have large uh, home appliances. We have small ones, kitchen appliances. Wow, security and sensors. Oh, ang dami. Okay, so maybe next time we'll have, uh, we'll be able to buy more. Uh, uh, remember to visit their uh, official store in Lazada. Ang dami dun. So let's, for now, itong socket lang yung kailangan natin. So electrician, uh, socket Wi-Fi. Okay? So uh, it will show you na yung naka-smiley face yung 2.4 gigahertz because all of most of the smart devices, 2.4 gigahertz compatible lang, meaning yung channel uh, ng iyong router, ng wireless router. Uh, some have 5 gigahertz, hindi siya doon magko-connect. Okay? So, and then, you need to input your Wi-Fi uh, network kung saan mo to ikakabit, and then put in your password. Uh, yung, def yung password na yun, masasave sa device. So, if you're going to change your password, you need to go back to this uh, setup and change the, the password dito sa device ulit para makakonect siya. Okay? So, click on next. So, now, power on the device after it has been powered off for 10 seconds. Okay? So, power on natin ngayon using our extension cord. Power on the device after it has been powered off for 10 seconds. Okay? So, ngayon, naka-power on na. It's blinking. Okay? Click next. Press and hold the reset button for 5 seconds until the indicator blinks. So, let's try. 5 seconds. Although, nagbiblink na siya ngayon. Let's go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay. So, nagbiblink na siya. Faster na ngayon. Okay. Click next. Okay. Uh, indicator blink 3 times per second. Okay. So, mas mabilis na siya. 3 times per second. Yes. And then, click confirm the indicator is blinking rapidly. Kasi kanina, slow blinking lang, di ba? So, click next. Now, it will attempt to look for the device automatically. Let's see kung mahanap niya. Ayan, may nangyayari. Nawala yung blinking. So, baka nagkita sila. Tingnan natin. Okay. Re-register na niya yung device. Initializing the device. Okay. So, now we have our app so uh, our uh, smart plug on our app so done okay so it's there uh, it's no longer the top so let's see uh, okay okay umilaw na shot umilaw naging puti na rin dun sa app so let's try to name this one or uh, we can rename it okay let's go eco plug icon name let's try our uh, I have here my the flamingo lamp earlier so let's try to uh, name it as 
flamingo. Let's see. Flamingo. Save. So, yun na yung pangalan ng ating smart plug. And then, let's see if it works. So, let's try to plug this in. Let's make sure it's default as turned on. Okay. So, it's on. And then, I'll try to plug it in here. Okay. So, umilaw siya. So, let's see if we can uh, turn it on or off. Off. So, it turned off. Okay, let's turn it on again. On. Off. Okay. So, you'll hear a small uh, sound inside the uh, the device na parang may a jumper or in on niya. See? It's on and off. Now, the feature for this is you can schedule it. So, you can add a schedule. You can put in what time, what day, uh, kung kailan mo gustong automatically uh, mag-on off siya. Uh, like what I did with my dispenser, mag-on siya at this certain time and mag-off siya para tipid sa kuryente. And then, pwede ring timer, meaning countdown, if you want to turn it on just for, let's say, just for 8 hours, lagay mo, or just for 1 hour. So, then mamamatay siya automatically. And then, meron pang random, random on and off. And then, circulate. So, meron ding uh, nag-circulate yung, yung time every when, every, uh, let's say, every 30 minutes, mag on off. Okay. It's pretty nice. Okay. So, let's try to put this in uh, our, our Google app. So, let's close this. And then you go to your uh, Google Home, and then uh, you'll see here the list of devices. Uh, if you, as you can see, I already have several devices. I have my fan in my bedroom, uh, a Google Home, uh, Google Mini speaker, and my aircon. I have four lights in the living room, another Home Mini speaker, uh, and then my dispenser. So I have another uh, TV. I haven't set it up yet. Pero that's the, the other TV downstairs. So, uh, in order for us to add, you just need to uh, click on the Add button on top and then set up a device. Okay. Now, uh, it's already set up, right? So, we choose Works with Google because this one, uh, like what it said, it works with Google Home. So, let's add it. Uh, works with Google. And then, it will search for that app na nakakonekto. Uh, if you can see, I have my broad link, uh, and then I have my iwi link, which is yung dalawa kong, uh, dalawa kong plug is iwi uh, link yung pangalan, and my magic home is my uh, my lights, my smart things is my uh, my Samsung TV. So now we will try to look for Lasco. Here we go. Lasco Home. So you click Lasco Home. Uh, what it will do is it will merge uh, uh, the two. So lagay mo yung uh, email address that you registered your Lasco in. So I have my email. And then put in the, the password that you you included mm. I have and then linked it now once it links uh, signing on so you need to authorize that Google uh, Google Home can use your Lasco app so authorize Okay, and now it's linking. So you need to assign uh, what room. So let's assign, let's say, uh, it's also in the living room. Okay, and then press done. Okay, so got it. So successfully added. So let's go back. So you should be able to see it here. Let's see. Okay, so we have our smart plug. It's already in the living room. Uh, it's called flamingo. So if uh, if we turn it turn it on here, 
You see, Flamingo, turn it on. It will turn on. Okay. Now, if you want to uh, ask Google, uh, uh, just tell him to turn on the Flamingo. Hey, Google. Turn on Flamingo. Okay, turning on Flamingo. And there you have it. And that's it on how to set up your Lasco smart plug device. So if you have questions or probably having trouble setting it up, feel free to put in your comments so uh, I'll try to respond. Uh, and don't forget to like and subscribe the channel. So if you're curious about the universal IR remote control, uh, watch the next video.